Next exercise is the lap focus row. Again, I do this easily on the prime machine row. So pick something of similar-ish variety, which is the Atlantis. I love this machine. I wish that we had it at Ultra Flyers. It's one of my favorites, especially for laps. So one of the common mistakes that people make once, once they start to trade properly with their form on lap movements is that they try to keep their scapula a little bit too restricted. You do want active protraction or retraction, but you do want to allow the scapula to move, otherwise you'll not be able to get stretch and squeeze. So when you bring your arm to almost a, a straight position, because you want to fully extend your arm on every single rep, you can allow for that little bit of travel forwards. I've still got tension in my lap there, but I am getting a full stretch. And then as you drive it through, lots of people kind of leave it there, bring it all the way into your hip for that almost thinking about your lap wrapping into your spine, you'll get a really nice squeeze. The better you can keep your range of motion, the better the movement will be.